Hello. Today, we're gonna build a house in the Sims 4, but the challenge is that each room is a different style. So, let's go. I mean my little spin spinny wheel. And yes, we're gonna use the style panel that's in the Sims and not the actual styles that's in the world right now. The different aesthetics, you could say. And I wanted to try this challenge because I have often found myself using the styles when I build and then finding out that they suck, all right? Most of them don't make any sense at all. They're either missing items or they're just completely wrong. All right, anyways, <laughs> before we begin with the spinning, let's just have a little look at our lock. So here is my little shell. It's an interesting shell. Shape. You know, I even got this going on. I don't know what to do about that, but it's there. I, of course, again, put in some doors and stairs because otherwise, if it's not in the pack, I'm gonna be in big, big trouble. Yeah, so I put them in. I even did some funky stairs. Uh, Nora became a little creative yesterday and as I see it now, I'm like, what the heck is going on here? Right, let's have a little look-see at the layout, shall we? We shall. Okay, so here is the entryway slash hallway. These two are connected by spirit. It's gonna be one room. Here's the bathroom. Here is the dining room. And we have the kitchen. A little pantry that's connected to the kitchen. It's one room. And here is the living room. Oh la la. And upstairs, we have another hallway. A master bedroom. A bathroom. And a kid's bedroom. Teen's bedroom we shall see yes so that was the layout and we are of course going to start with the exterior of the house not the front garden just the exterior because we have a lot of styles to go through oh and before we start this challenge i just want to thank you guys so much for voting in my poll deciding on which kit i was gonna get and the winner for that poll was the book nook kit and the greenhouse haven kit so i have bought them that i have i bought them and i have taken a little look at them and i love them so thank you so much for voting on that it really helped me out because i had no idea what kit i I was going to get so thank you but let's go one two three spin that wheel shotgun what does that mean can i even say that word on youtube okay so this is what it is right oh it's one of those long skinny houses because of history well all right do we have windows we have windows we have doors we have wallpaper what more could you ask for nothing what color should we pick you know what i'm just gonna go for a plain all white we can get a little brick moment in here too do i like this brick i don't even know maybe i I do or maybe i don't maybe just that break yeah so let's get a nice old front door in i'm gonna start off with the white door and maybe i'll change the color let's see what happens with that now for the roof why didn't i begin with the roof but i begin with the door i confuse myself sometimes this is a very interesting roof let's start off with this looking very nice for the back roof maybe that a gabled roof that's what it's called i don't know the names of the roofs i'm sorry i'm not a roof person we can have a half gabled roof see i'm learning the names already and then we can have half gabled roof here oh you know what i can do i can finally do some magic let's have a porch here because i saw somebody do that one time and i was blown away okay i'm gonna take this in and i'm gonna copy it take that side in and then i'll take no that's not what i wanted take that side out funky welcome to funky town uh, this is an interesting house that i gotta say it's an interesting house okay what am i gonna do here then i need to do something there and quick okay so i can do this type of roof or i can do this that's the only two things i can do how does that look Look. Yeah. Oh no, I'm really stuck now. Okay, what if I do this and then this? You know, yeah, that can work. Okay, it's not the best thing I built ever, but it's a start. And that's where I'm heading. Now let's put some little windows in. My absolute favorite activity, the windows. Maybe I can go for this. Yeah, I'm gonna go for that. Oh, the stairs. Right, I can go for this. What does that look like on the... Oh, I think that looks fine. Okay, I'm gonna say I'm finished with the windows. Now I know that some of the window placements are really strange, especially this, but I have to think about the inside too, all right? Because this is gonna be the kitchen and I can't just have windows bungling up up in there. But don't you worry, I'm gonna hide it up with some bushes and some trees. It's gonna be fine. Then I can put in some columns just to fix this place. I do love to put in columns everywhere I go. It just makes everything a lot nicer in life, even though I don't really like these columns. But hey-ho, there she blows. Okay, I'm just gonna say it right now. I don't like this house. I do not. I can put in these. Does that help? Tell me. Does <laughs> I mean, maybe it does. Who am I to judge? Maybe, maybe it does help. Right, is there anything else we can put in? So there's nothing in decoration. That's shotgun. That's good. Show all, maybe. Oh, is that it? That's it. Oh my. Well, I guess I can put in these little lights then. That's all I can do. Right, so this is the exterior of the house. Now don't mark me. I know it looks bad, okay? I... 
It's definitely not the best thing I've ever done, but it was very limiting with that style. I mean, it was no decorations at all. So, um, yeah. Oofly doofly. So, right, let's move on. And we're gonna move on to the front garden of the house. Spin that wheel. Ooh, basics. Um, what does that mean? Styles. Basics. Do they have any plants? They have trees. How is this a basic tree? How is this basics? Do we have bushes? We have bushes. Do we have any rocks? We have this rock, which is from Debug. Interesting. Do we have any other garden stuff? Let's see. We have a little whale. That is terrifying. Do we have any terrain tools? Nope, we do not. That can be a pathway if you try hard enough. I mean, we're not gonna go for marble. Imagine this house, this shotgun inspired house having a marble flooring. <laughs> All right, so I was thinking of having a little flower bed moment in here, like so, like a little fenced in, but that's not gonna work with these. And it's definitely not gonna work with that. So what I think I'm gonna do instead is make a half wall. Oh no, well that's not good. What if I move it? Right, what do I do then? Is there anything else I can use as a fence? I mean, we have this. Oh, I can use that for my pathway. That's super fancy. Like show. Uh, we have these. Can we use that as a fence? Who knows? This is gonna be a very exotic garden, I feel like. I do feel so. <laughs> I guess I can just go for these thingy thangies. Try to contain them all in. Like so. <laughs> I mean, that is definitely something though. That it is. It's definitely something. I'm gonna move this here. <laughs> as if that made anything better. But anywho, so let's get a little carpet for the front door. We have some, that's good. Wait, what? So this carpet with a dog that has a line over it is in basics, but the carpet with a dog without the line over it is not in basics. Why? That is so strange. Can I use these carpets as like sand? Maybe I can. That kind of looks like sand. I'm gonna do that. Hold on. Because this is like a sandy plant place. Yeah, I know. So we need some sand. You can't really see it, but I know it's there. I can have that as a little front door carpet. What more can I have on this little porch? I can have this little plant thing. Whoa. What is that? And it was just, let's fence this all in, like so. Uh, and then we- Oh no! This is two tiles wide and my plan 20 is three. Oh no, what do I do now? Okay, if I have the gate here, that lines up with everything going on there. Oh no, but jeebus me. Okay, so I can't have it three tiles wide because that's just a little too chunky. But if I delete this part, it just doesn't feel right. But if I delete this part, it also doesn't look right. So what do I do? Okay, the thing I'm going to do is move the whole Whole lot one tile back. I don't care if he's cheating or not. I don't care because right now I gotta take care of my mental health. That's all I gotta think about right now. It's my mental health. And now it fits perfectly. That was good. Very good for my mental health. Do we have any mailboxes? If we do not have any mailboxes, I'm gonna cry. Oh, we have. Okay, we have this normal one. I have this cat. Why is this in basics? Well, I'm gonna have the dog then. There we go. Right, now for the trash bins. I mean, actually for the trash bins, maybe we can make a little, little one of these like so. So it kind of looks built in, you know? Yeah, I think that looks nice. It looks kind of built in. How is this basic? We have some meat cubes for some reason, right? We can have a clothing line. Is that something you would have in a front garden? I feel like that's more of a back garden shenanigan. Just gonna place some of these around just for some overgrowth, some character, some character building, you know? <laughs> you can also have just a little outside table. Uh, I mean, okay. Okay, maybe the pet bowl can be here. You know, he's, he's joining these people and then we can have this right there. Yeah. Do we have something to put on that table? Do we? Anything at all. What about a toothbrush? Ah, we're just gonna get that plant. Hope you're happy with that. Okay, so that was the front garden. Um, I mean, it's okay. It is a front garden. What more do you want? You know, I, you know what? I had plants. I had plants for the plants, but then it got ruined with not having any sort of fences or stuff that matches. Wow. We even got a little bike and we got a tree and even some trash bins. Wow. So yeah, let's move on from this. And today we're not gonna start with the hallway and entryway. No, no, no. Today, we're gonna start with the kitchen. We're gonna mix it up a little bit and we're gonna start with the kitchen. So, let's generate for that, shall we? We freaking shall. Generate me kitchen. Ooh, French country. Is that good or bad? I don't really know. Let's have a little look-see. French country. Ooh, we got a phone booth at least. I mean, that's a good start. Oh, I even got a little pig. A little chef pig. That's cute. No, no focus. What was I here for? Kitchen. Okay, we got fridges. Good, good, good. We have a stove. Do we have canners? Oh, we do. Okay, I'm happy. I can make a cool... Oh, do we have sinks? We have sinks. I'm happy. Let's make a kitchen. So let's begin with the counters. I feel inspired to make 
make a little blue kitchen. That I do. So let's start with that. Oh, yeah. This is horrible. I do not want the stove in front of the window. Where the hell am I gonna put the stove then? Nowhere. I need to plan my houses better. This is not good. Can I do something controversial? What if I have the stove here? Like so. I'm looking for guidance here. Maybe I can do something like that. I can try that. It is a French country kitchen after all. I mean, old kitchens are weird as heck. Let's get some cabinet. All right, this is what bothers me in The Sims. It's a lot of things, but this is one of them. And it has to do with the counters. So you see this end piece counter, this one. You see that it's not a full tile, right? And then you have the end piece cabinet and you're thinking, oh, it makes sense that the end piece cabinet is the same size as the end piece counter, but it's not. It's not. You see the end piece cabinet, it's a full tile. Why? Why is it like that? So that means that the end piece cabinet and end piece counter doesn't match up in size. Pourquoi? Perfect and quoi. So now it just looks all wiggly waggly woggly. Thank you for coming to my TED talk. That was all. That was frick frack all. So now it's just looking ridiculous. Can I do this? I squeeze it in a little bit, but not too much. Yeah, that's a little bit better. I'm gonna do that instead. Let's uh, get some wallpaper. I forgot that. I was too disturbed by the counters. Wait, if I do this and then I have some brick here. Uh, I don't know if I like that or not. I'll go for that for now. Right, the flooring. Oh, that's nice. I like that. I like that a lot. Maybe right here we can have a little stone moment if we have any good stone. I mean, that's a good stone, but oh, ah, it doesn't line up with the counter. Right. What if I squeeze it a little bit like this? Yeah, that's, that's better. Wait, that's strange. What? I didn't know this. Look at the wall and look at the tile. The wall is going over the tile. That is so strange. What? So now the wall doesn't match up with the stone. You know what? I give up. Nothing lines up, but whatever. Right, let's get a little uh, one of these. A little stove hood. There we go. Okay, before I start decorating the kitchen and stuff, I am gonna do the pantry before I forget. Oh no, this is going to ruin my plans. So for a pantry, we need shelves. And if this style thing doesn't have any shelves, I'm in big trouble. So surfaces, shelves. <gasps> okay, we have this shelf. Is that good? Yeah, I can work with that. So first of all, I'm just gonna search up pantry. Wow, that's kind of nice. That's kind of cool. Cool and fresh and fun. Yeah, something like this. Maybe something like so. Then we need some decor. Don't really have a lot of choices, but we have some choices. I mean, the ideal thing would have been to have food there, but um, we don't really have that. <laughs> right, I'm gonna continue with the shelves. Nothing's gonna stop me now. No, <laughs> this is not going good for me at all because these shelves aren't connecting. And if I put in another shelf like so, it's gonna clip like hell and that's annoying. So what if I do this? Yeah, I'm gonna do that and I'm gonna call it a day. Also just gonna put in a little event. It gets a little, a little musty in there, you know? Yeah, so back to the kitchen. Can have one of these on the stove to make some ambiance. I need some curtains that I need. Yeah, the curtains. Yeah, that curtain is not gonna work. Be gone. You know what? This window is not gonna get in curtains. It really isn't. This is being difficult. All right, I am now done with the kitchen. Here it is. Look, I got a little stove. A little stove moment. Uh, uh, here's the kitchen. We got a little pantry. Let's have a look. Oh, oh la la. Look at this pantry. Look at her go. Beautiful kitchen. Wow. Okay, that was the kitchen. And now we're gonna move on to the bathroom. Oh, you would have guessed that. No, but we're gonna move on to the bathroom. Spin the wheel. Ooh, farmhouse. Why am I getting so much farm stuff? Do we have toilets? We have toilets. We have sinks. We have showers. Do we have bathtubs? Oh, yes, we do. I mean, that's good. And by the way, this bathroom is really long. I need to do something about that longness. Hold on. What if I get a fence like so? And then I raise this piece up a little bit. And then I put my bathtub here. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe that piece is a little too much. Yeah, that's better. That's gonna be cool. All right, flooring. What flooring do we want? Ooh, I can go with that. That's kind of a vibe. And then for the wallpaper. I can go with that, actually. That kind of fits. Or am I just tired? Who knows? We don't have any platform trims. Oh, no. We have stairs. The stairs work. I mean, yeah. And then a nice all sink. Where am I gonna put the toilet? That's a good question. I mean, I can just put the toilet in the corner. I'm gonna put baby in a corner. Oh, curtains. That is bad. That's the only thing that we have right now. It doesn't even go down to the window. Don't look at it too much. It's gonna be okay. Don't look at it. What else can we have in here? We can have this little man. We can watch you while you're in the tub. Yes. And we can have this barrel for some reason. Oh, we can have this little radio. I mean, you, you would want a little radio while you're in the bathtub, right? We don't really have any carpets. Oh, no. We are hay. I mean, I'm not even gonna question it. Not even gonna question it no more. You can have this fancy chandelier above the bath. Then you can have this little oil lamp while you're on the toilet. You need to worry about the 
oil lamp hitting you. Okie dokie. That was the bathroom. I mean, we got an oil lamp, got some sinks, got the beautiful bathtub. Oof. Nice pictures on the wall as well. Kind of looks like modern Morgoth, slightly. But who knows who it is. I think this bathroom turned out all right, except for that. I kind of panicked. We didn't have any carpet, so I had to improvise. And the improvisation was not good at all. So yeah, that was the bathroom. And now, now me lovelies, we are gonna move on to the living room. Shall we? We shall. Let's spin that wheel. Ooh, contemporary. That's exciting. I don't really know what that means, but it probably means something. So let's um make a contemporary living room. We have couches. We have chairs. That's good. What about the floors? Oh, we have no wooden floors. We have these ugly carpets. We have tiles, which it doesn't work as a living room flooring, okay? It doesn't work. We get gravel and we got whatever that is. And that's it. Okay, what about the wallpaper? Oh no, I might just end this video here. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna start with the furniture first and let's see what we shall do with the wallpaper and flooring in the end. Because right now, yikes. What can we do here? TV? I mean, that's a sad TV to have in this <laughs> huge living room, isn't it? What about some of that? I have totally hidden the windows, by the way. That's okay. Maybe we can have some art there instead. Instead of a TV. They don't believe in TVs. What if I take this one and I size that up a little bit? That can work. I can work with that. Then I can get a couch in here. I mean, is that too funky of a couch or do I like the couch? I think I like the couch. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. What if I do this? And I sink the living room down a little bit. Oh my gosh, these cabinets are not going to the floor. That's absolutely amazing. Just how I want it to be. What if I just take this little wooden block? Then I just squeeze it in there. It's gonna work. Promise you. It's gonna work. I make so many problems for myself that just don't have to be problems at all, you know? But that's just me. El problemo. Wow. I used so much time on that. Or was it necessary? I don't think so. And then over here, what can we have over here? Interesting. Activities. We have massage chairs. Well, that's not helpful. Maybe I can just have a little another sitting area. I don't really know. But maybe I can. You know, just for some more private conversations over there. Ooh, I can squeeze this in here though. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's find some wallpaper at least. That can work. I mean, yeah, that can work. Uh, but, okay, the flooring. Yikes, the flooring. Oh no, that is bad. That is so bad. Well, this is the living room. I don't want to talk about it. I really don't want to talk about it. I mean, I like the couch and stuff. That I do. But the flooring and the wallpaper, my spirit died. It really did. And, oh, my bookshelf is going through the roof. But whatever. I was the living room. Now we shan't move on to the hallway. Spin that wheel garden. I mean, okay, maybe it will be good. Maybe. Garden. Okay, we have some flooring. Really questionable flooring, but we have flooring. What else do we have? Well, just garden stuff. That's what I would have <laughs> guessed, but I do like that. That I indeed do. Right, let's see the flooring. Why is this in the garden section? Who knows? What is that? Barely concrete. Okay, let's um go for the concrete then. I'm gonna put in some half walls to secure this in, which does not work. Interesting. I'm gonna hide that up later. I can have this little thing, so you can put your keys on that? Who knows? Do we have any carpets? No, we don't. <laughs> oh, I can have this there. And then in here, I can have a little plant. I can have this huge old plant over there. Maybe two. Oh, beautiful. Can I have that little gnome? Can I have this little sitting sitting stool right there? <laughs> For some reason. Oh, love me some flowers. There you go. Hope you're very happy with that. Because I surely am. Then we can use the bushes to hide up that little mess back there. Very beautiful. And we can have a little fountain. Oh, but jeepers me. That's an ugly room. Well, okay. So this is me hallway. I really hope you like it. Because I... <laughs> <laughs> I surely do not. Oh no. This is so bad. I I can't. No. I'm moving on. Forget about this. Forget about it. And now we're going to move on to the dining room. Spinning the wheel. Ooh. Okay, island. Let's see if island has something cool. First of all, does it have a dining table? Oh, it does. I'm going to use this one. Not even have to question it. Right, wallpaper. Oh. You know, I do kind of like this vibe. Kind of weird, but um, I'm going with it. I'm going with the island theme. Can we get a nice old carpet? I mean, I can try this one. Is there a better color? No. It's going to be that then. Do we have curtains? Curtains. Oh, we actually do. What a wonderful life. What else can we have in here? They can squeeze through that. Yeah. No, now as I think about it, uh... No, they can squeeze through that. I've thought about it. They can squeeze. If they're gonna live in this world, they have to squeeze. I don't know. That's the only picture we have. Oh no. We can have the fork and spoon. There you go. Oh, you can also get this little fan. There you go. Right. There is a dining room. Wow, wow, wow. I kind of like it, actually. I really do like it. It has a vibe. It has some good vibes in here. I like it. I love it. Well, I don't love it, but I like it. Now we're gonna move on. And we're gonna move on. The upstairs master bedroom. Oh, my camera ran out of battery. So that was fun. Let's spin for the master bedroom, shall we? We shall. Vintage. Vintage, vintage. We have beds. Ooh. 
Oh, that's a nice band. Okay, what about the flooring? We only have one flooring and it's this. I do not like this flooring. It's just too much, you know? It's really too much. But I can try. Bedside tables? What about these ones? Yeah, I can try that. But I am gonna size them down a little bit because they are mahusive. That they are. That's a little bit better. And let's see what the wallpapers have to bring us. Oh, yeah. I do not like any of them. But this one's kind of cool. Can I have the whole room like that? Or is that too much? But this doesn't really match, does it? You know what? You're just gonna have the whole bedroom like this. There you go. Hope you're very happy with that. Otherwise, you're gonna be disappointed. Oh, we can have a little desk. Oh, that's super cute. How is this vintage, by the way? Or maybe it's like retro, but it's definitely not vintage vintage. I gotta say, it's not. I found this little cross-stitching kit. What if we have a little chair in the car now? Oh, don't really like any of these chairs. Or I do like this chair, but none of the swatches really match. Yeah. I know. Do we have any normal chairs? I mean, we have this one. I don't think that's better. Well, it's gonna be that chair in white. Doesn't really match, but um, what you gotta do? Nothing. Get a little scones. Little scones. Oh, that's the only plant we have. Oh no. Right. That's not really good. We have this little magazine holder. You know, they've been reading the magazines. Well, let's try and put up some curtains. I am just gonna go with this. It's the safest bet I have right now. Oof. They're not looking good. And now I'm done with a beautiful bedroom. I mean, <laughs> I wish I could have done more with this, but I had no more decorations to use. No plants. No furniture that fitted. Nothing. I don't. It's a choice for a bedroom. That it is. It's a choice for a bedroom. And now we're going to move on to the little kids bedroom, teens bedroom. We shall see what happens there. So spin the wheel. Oh my god, I got cute. I'm so happy right now. What is my freak frag look? Cute. Do we have a bed? Yes, we have a bed. Okay. Oh, this is it. This is all the stuff that's in the cute category. All right. I'm going to try and make a little purple bedroom. Do we have curtains? We have no curtains. Thus, we do not. All right. The bed. Where am I going to have the bed? Right there. Yeah, it's gonna be right there. Do we have a nightstand? Oh, we do. We have this one. Beautiful. We have no plants. Oh, but you me. Ooh. Okay, we have this. I can go in there, can't it? It's a little bit of a squeeze. But sure. And the chair. Get the cap print one. Oh, that's cute. Let's see. What do we have? We have this. We can have that there. In a funky, funky color. I'm just gonna have white. The funkiest color that ever existed. I can have a little trash can. Do I have space for that? I mean, I can have it there. Why not? And also have this. Just on the door. You know, it's a kid's bedroom. They're allowed to do wacky stuff like that. I mean, I can't really do anything else. I don't have more decorations. I really don't. So that was it. That was a beautiful kid's bedroom. I kind of like it. I know. I love it. I wish I had a little bit more decorations, but there literally is not. It's just nothing to choose from, you know? So what am I gonna do? Nothing. So here is it. I like it. All right, now we're gonna move on to the bathroom. Spin the wheel. Cosmo looks. Okay. I'm kind of nervous. Is there anything bathroom related in here? Oh my gosh. We have a toilet. We have sinks. We have a shower. We have bathtubs. Oh my gosh. Okay, good. Good, good, good. I'm happy. Wallpaper. That's all the wallpaper that's in the Cosmolux. Amazing. What about flooring? This is all. Well, oh, okay. I guess I gotta go with that. You know, I can't go for the carpets. It's a bathroom. So that it is then. Oh my gosh. Okay, there's the tub in front of the beautiful windows. You know what I am gonna do though? I'm gonna use some half walls. And now we have a little built-in tub. Beautiful. Couldn't have asked for more. Or I could, but uh, I don't dare to do that. Do we have any curtains? We do not have any curtains. Isn't that wonderful? What about a carpet? Oh, yeah. That is very interesting. A very interesting carpet indeed. <laughs> you can each get your own little bath mat. There you go. And you know, since they each have their own little bath mat, they have to have their own mirror. That's only given. Oh. Start to own a decoration. Well, then they're also gonna have their own little corner for their own robe. There you go. What about pictures? Oh, this is the only picture we have. Superb. Yeah, what else do we have? That's the only decorations we have. Well, I can, I can squeeze that in there. A little privacy for the toilet, you know? That is very much needed. Yes. Alright, that was the bathroom. I mean, it's something. I literally couldn't do anything else in that. I mean, there was no decorations at all. But I think it turned out okay. That, I think. You know, it's a bathroom. You got everything you need. Let's move on. And we're, of course, gonna move on to the last room of the house. The hallway. So let's do that. Spin the wheel. Oh, mission. Okay, that's good. I can deal with that. I can deal with some mission. Oh my gosh. Something has happened with the roof. And I think it's because of this. That is glitching. But I think, uh, it is what it is. It is what it freaking is. First of all, do we have some fences? We have. can use this. That's nice. What about some flooring? Ooh, right. I am not used to any of these types of flooring. I mean, these types of flooring does not exist in Norway at all. That would have been a bad thing if you had that in Norway. Because your feet would freeze off. I mean, I kind of like that flooring. Should I go with stone? Since I'm already here, you know? Maybe. Or maybe
maybe just wood. Who knows? The curtains. Oh, yikes. Oh, oh. Apparently, this is mission. Mission impossible. Yeah, I can try with these. And we can have one over the door as well. Just to hide everything up in case the strangers come by. If the stranger come by and walks onto the <laughs> patio up here, um, who knows? Who knows what happens in The Sims, you know? It might happen. It might happen. Oh my gosh, the roof. Ignore the roof, okay? Just ignore it. It's okay. It's fine. Maybe we can have a little couch here. Then the bookshelf can be here. Beautiful. Maybe a mirror. Maybe they want to look at themselves in the mirror. Okay, do we have any carpets? Okay, we have. This carpet shows up in every single style. Don't really know what's happening there, but something is definitely happening. Right, so that was the hallway. My little vision hallway. Um, again, not much <laughs> decorations to choose from, but I kind of like it. I think it's so cozy. It's a cozy little hallway. I do like it. I must say, I do say so. And now we are gonna move on to the little patio. So I left our patio, so let's do that. One, two, three, spin away. Oh, shabby. I mean, maybe that's good. I have no idea what shabby is. If it got a table, then I'm happy. Shabby. Got this table. Now <laughs> we do. Okay, do we have some sitting chairs then? Yep, we do. That's a vibe. That's a vibe for sure. I mean, just like so. Do we have a little table? Oh, I mean, we can round it off with this. <laughs> sure. Do you have any plants? Oh, we have plants. Ooh, we can go for that. You know, they have been gardening up here. That they have. They have been gardening. Yeah, what else do we have? Got a tire. I can put that in there. They can have a tire for some unknown reason. They can even have a little guitar up here. They even got some newspapers. Wow, wow, wow. They can have a little broom, you know, just in case they need it. <gasps> they can have a little TV. Because that's what they do here. They watch their TV. I mean, this is a scene. Really, that's something. <laughs> right, so that was a little patio. I kind of like it, actually. It has some character. It really does. It really does have some character. You know, they just come out here to watch their programs, get away from mom, you know? And who cares if the TV gets broken in the rain? They got it for free from a dumpster, you know? So, let's move on. And we are going to move on to the last part of this build, which is the backyard. One, two, three, go! Holidays. Oh, I'm about to end this right now. Holidays. What is in the holidays? Oh my gosh. That's it. All right. Do we have some flooring? Nope. We have wallpaper. Nope. Doors? No. Windows? No. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Right. So this is the only things we have. You know what? Get a little tree right there. We can get a little pig. Why is this in holidays? Aprons. I'm confused. Oh, we can have these. Only in that color. Well, I guess beggars can't be choosers. There you go. Hope. We're happy with that. And um, if you can have this. Thing. You're very welcome. All right, that was the backyard. Uh, what more can I say? It's uh, the most amazing thing I've ever seen in my entire life. I have to say. It um, truly is. Happy, happy with the backyard. All right, <laughs> that was it for this time. Hope you really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it until the end. Then I didn't enjoy it because what a, the backyard, what, what? Like, the backyard, it brings out the worst of luck in me, ever. I don't understand it. But yeah, anyways, that's the house. Hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> If you for some reason want to download this house, I don't know why you would, but if you want to, I have it up on my gallery, and my gallery ID is just Nora Gaming. Bob. And um, yeah, thank you so so much for watching, and uh, don't forget to like and subscribe because it really does help me out. So um, thank you, and uh, I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.